Well, new tonight, the temps are dropping in here in the upstate. Homeless shelters are filling up. Some even over the capacity there, even with emergency shelters opening up as well. Yeah, Fox Carolina's Anna Arinder is live in studio for us this afternoon. That's right, Anna, you spoke with the ministry who says that they need help and they want to provide a warm bed for anyone in need. Well, Justin, that's right. Nearly 3,300 people in Greenville County are experiencing homelessness, and that's according to the Greenville Homeless Alliance. The Salvation Army tells me that their goal is to minimize that growing number as much as possible, but they can't do it alone. While we do have a limitation of space, we will never have a limitation of love of service. The Salvation Army of Greenville says their emergency shelters are open, but they're not taking in any guests. Both of our shelters are completely at capacity and our men's facility is over their regular bed count. Steven says the reality is one shelter only has room for 35 women and children and the other for 53 men. They do allow guests to stay more than one night, offering them services to help them get back on their feet. When they come into us, we work with them on establishing, you know, what does tomorrow mean for you? How do we start this conversation? And then how do we help you navigate the really choppy waters of starting over? And so folks stay with us from any length of time. They could stay one night and then they leave and go somewhere else, or they could stay six months to a, over a year. She says, unfortunately, there are some people who can't handle staying in a shelter sometimes choosing to sleep outside. We see folks on the front porch of our church almost every single day. Direct things that could be of help to us right now are twin size blankets, our twin size sheets, bottled water, and pop top meals. We really want Greenville to know that the Salvation Army needs you right now in every way, shape and form that we're trying to serve the least and the lost and the unloved here. Well, with the temperatures dropping, the Salvation Army also is in need of coats. Steven says that those who aren't who are homeless don't just use them to stay warm. It's a mattress and a comforter and a protection from the elements. They also say that money donations are a huge help as well. I'm Anna Arinder, Tori, Justin, back to you. Now,